What's going on smart people and welcome to the final daily physics upload. Yesterday I was reading through a bunch of the comments and leaving all the hearts and stuff. I realized what am I doing? I should just make a video today where I go over your comments and see what you all had to say. So a lot of these I have seen already, but a lot of them I still haven't because there's quite a few. So let's just let's just jump right into it. Going into the first one, McCullen Allred 314 LOL. Man, what a stupid stupid name. McCullen. I'm just kidding. It's one of my best friends. Actually, fun fact, part of the reason why I'm stopping this daily video series on 314 is because he told me that he sees that number everywhere and it kind of triggers him. So what kind of friend would I be if I didn't mess with him a little bit? Mirajan, I like this idea. This is one of the grad students at NMSU, so he was one of the people I talked to to see if they would be okay with me bringing my camera. So that's good to know that you're on board. At first, I read this as, tomorrow is my last upload, I almost had a heart attack. No, 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 I don't know what I would do. I don't have very much free time, but to not make any more videos, that would be, I think I would get bored, to be honest. Taking your camera to lecture sounds cool. Yeah, I, I'm not gonna be like recording the lectures or anything like that. A, a lot of things need to stay kind of private. I'm not gonna record, you know, giving lab or, or teaching or anything like that. There's there's certain amount of, uh, uh, things that are just off topic that I can't record, but I'll still try to make it as interesting as possible. You got to do some more skits. You're funny as hell. Here are some of the other potential ideas. I did ask you all to let me know some suggestions. Explaining physics concepts in two sentences. I thought I made a video. I have like a whole notebook full of video ideas and then things that I've already made. I don't know. I think I made a video where I did, uh, Physics in like certain amount of words or less. I don't remember though. Physics grad, expectations versus reality. I was holding off on that video until I was actually a grad student. That way I could have, uh, I would be able to talk about things like TAing and things that I hadn't experienced yet last semester. Cost of physics PhD, yeah, these are good ideas. You should collab with Papa Flammy on a physics derivation on one of the Tuesday videos. That would be super epic. We could challenge each other on like deriving something in totally obscure ways. That, that would be pretty fun. You should have a channel for tutoring math and physics. Think about it. I don't know, I kinda got my hands full with, with everything else right now. Episode floor pi times 100. Not only will the quality of videos and homogeneity increase, it'll help you focus on yourself more. Great idea, and remember, we'll always watch your videos. That was a super nice comment. I am excited for how much I don't think I'll be spending any less time on videos. In fact, it, I'm kind of worried about it actually spending more time because of how long actual vlogs take to edit. So we'll see how that goes. But uh, I am excited to be dedicating more of that time to one specific video instead of spreading it out and coming up with a whole bunch of mediocre ones. You should go to 365. I was thinking about it, that's, that's, but that's like at the end of this semester. That would probably kill me. Uh, gonna be 3.14 or 314 coincident. No, it definitely wasn't a coincidence. Can we get an F in the sh in the chat? Jesse Kyle, I love how I've made one Jesse Kyle video and people, it, it's like I've made a million of them or something. Hey, don't start from tensor calculus. Start from multivariable calculus and build from that. I am doing tensor calculus because I would have fun doing the tensor calculus. I think I would be extremely bored going over vector calc. Uh, so that's just not for me. There's there's tons of resources online for both. There's definitely way more on multivariable calculus. And I, like I said, that would just be boring to start with. I understand that that's not where a lot of the viewers who watch my channel uh, are at right now, but I'm okay with that because I would have more fun making those types of videos. And yeah, that's just what I'm gonna do. Early as Big Bang meme review. For those two Thursday videos that are supposed to be the more funny videos, uh, I am, I forgot to mention that I am probably going to incorporate the meme reviews into those, so not everyone will be a skit, sometimes it'll be something like that. This makes me immensely sad. I, I hope people understand, though, I I'm excited for a, a change of pace, and I can always go back to the daily stuff later on, but I think it's, it's good for a new season, a nice fresh start. 2.14. I think I, I misspelled Tuesday like three times in that video, two or three times. I was pretty tired. Uh, I agree, love your math videos, however, it's a little awkward to be watching your video, videos in the middle of lunch. <laughs> Frowny face. Can you prove one plus one equals two? Um, choosing units such that one plus one equals two. QED. 
Uh, thanks for all the great content. Daily videos will be missed. Yeah, but it's, it's always nice to move on from something. I think they're getting a little dry. Ready for Andrew Dawson season four. That's right. A hundred million new episodes. Fight me. Fight me. I, I'm, on, I'm like seven foot four, dude. Are you sure? I'm not. I'm really not. He looks more like a zany professor with each passing day. Every day the hair gets a little crazier, a little grayer. The beard gets equally as crazy. I'm just here for the ride, looking forward to everything. You should make fun physics phenomena video once a week. Fun physics phenomena. Hmm. I'd have to think about that. Ending the series of pi is a good choice. At exactly pi too. 3.14 is 100% pi. Hey. <laughs> the cat was messing with the guitar. Dots and Papa. Ha, huh, that's great. Looking forward to it. Is your last daily upload going to be the book review? No, uh, like I mentioned before, you know, I'm, I'm going to be uploading more than three times a week, a lot of weeks. So that's just going to be one of those extra videos. I might make that this week because, you know, this whole schedule isn't going to start until this next week coming up. That way I have time to plan for some of these videos. So maybe one or so videos will come out between now and this next Tuesday. And I think that might be one of them. Uh, great plan. My semester starts next week, so I wouldn't be able to consistently watch videos every day. Yeah. Uh, I, I mean, I know, I guess I do kind of watch YouTube every day, but only, like, I watch my daily PewDiePie. I've got to get it in. Got to get my daily news source. Yes, I really need Tensor Calculus. Bring it. It's, I, I can't wait to have that uploaded more consistently. It's going to be strange not having you ask me what's going on every day. F in the chat. Seriously, though, you're doing great, and you're an inspiration to all of us. Keep, keep... Keep on coming. Did you hear that, Memo? Did you hear that? Did you freaking hear that? I'm an inspiration. Jesse Kyle deserves his own channel. <laughs> That'd be pretty funny. Can't wait. Hope everything goes well for you this semester. Make a video of you TAing. Yeah, there's just like privacy of other people. Not everyone wants to be on camera. You know what I mean? The huge tensor boy is going to be a regular. That's right. To please derive the Fourier co coefficients. My optics professor just threw that in his homework. What do you think, Mamo? Fourier coefficients? One of these days? Can you even see her right now? No, you can't. She's perfectly out of frame. Love the channel. I barely know basic physics. I still watch these every day. I was doing the same thing, though, when I was first starting out in physics. I was watching people talk about shit that was way over my head, and it wasn't because... It, it was just... It was cool to see what was to come. Even though I couldn't understand it at the time, it was just cool knowing what other people eventually got to. I don't know. It was exciting. Sounds like an excellent plan. By the way, do you have Twitter, Instagram? Easy way to see it, send suggestions and interactions. I do have a Twitter. I don't really use it, but I'll link it in the description. There's also the subreddit that I created, uh, Smart People Post. And then I made a Discord. I haven't made it public yet because I'm, I'm still trying to understand the in and outs of how it works. But that'll be another thing. I'm not into Instagram, though. I like the idea. By the way, Andrew, do any of your students know about your YouTube channel? What about your grad student colleagues? Pretty much the cat's out of the bag for the grad students. They pretty much all know at this point. Uh, there's only been a couple of the students that I TA for that that uh, noticed that I have a YouTube channel. It was awkward at first, but then it, it became okay. Looking forward to Jesse Ka. Uh, from now on, Thursdays are going to be my favorite day. That's the comedy one. I think that's going to be most people's. It's like, the, it, honestly, the Tuesday ones are for me. I like making the heavier physics and math videos. No one watches it. That's fine but it's just ones that I like making. So, but Thursday ones, I think everyone else is gonna like. Um, and then I guess ever since Simon Clark graduated, there might be some void of the PhD student vlogger. So that one's, I'm gonna, it's big shoes to fill and I'm not gonna fill them, but I will try. How about every, anything can happen Thursday slash Sundays. So you just want, you definitely want the math video and then you know, whatever, anything else. Uh, I suggest you do, you do first and second year physics videos as well, especially E and M. Yeah, I mean, I I tend to do more of those subjects as I'm going through them in grad school. So I'll probably be making more like stat mech and thermodynamics videos this semester. Like I think I made some quite a few classical mechanics ones last semester. So I try to match what I upload to what I'm also going through because it's it's good practice for me as well. Um, I'm pretty excited for the weekly math videos. At least you get more time on Mondays. Yes. Uh, I will miss what we have, but definitely excited for what's to come. You misspelled Tuesday. I misspelled it twice. 
this title. Don't put me on edge like that, but like the new format, make tomorrow's video duration 314. I'm already at 1020 something right now, so that's not gonna happen. Easily, my favorite video from Papa Flamely was his video about two bodies colliding in free space. Maybe you could do some videos of similar topic. He does make really good physics videos. I like all, I like all the integral ones, but the physics videos are really good. Um, useless quest of blah, blah, blah. I think this new setup will be nice and refreshing. However, I'm worried that the funny videos will be hard to maintain without getting stale. Maybe think about bringing back physics memes every now and then. Yeah, that's exactly what I'm planning on doing. Because I agree. Yeah, there, some days, there's just not enough hours in the day to think of something perfectly clever, or perfectly clever, more clever. So those will probably be the days where it's like, all right, meme review. Uh, P.S. I enjoyed the Simon Clark and Daddy Flammy references. Definitely looking forward to the more focused content videos. Can't wait to see the derivations. I can't wait for it either. Looking forward to Sundays. Actually, all days sound so cool. I've, I'm, I haven't made like a proper vlog in a while, but I think I can do them better than I used to, which isn't saying much because they used to be pretty terrible. So we'll see. Physics meme review. You bet your ass I'm going to be doing some meme reviews on the Thursdays because some days I'm just not going to be as clever and I'll need an easier video idea. Uh, going to miss you, Doth. I'm not going anywhere. I'm just going to upload a little bit less frequently, a little bit better videos, hopefully. Uh, practice your lectures here for us. I'm thinking, you guys did get me thinking about doing that QFT lecture on YouTube. Probably not recording the actual lecture, but just what I talk about. So I'm considering doing that, maybe live streaming it or something. Because I've never live streamed before. So exciting! Woohoo! All the way from South Africa with University, and I love what you're doing. I'm in the second year doing physics major, and what you've predicted is happening. I'm super excited for the new change. Uh, I don't know what I've predicted. I will certainly miss the daily uploads, although this sounds cool. Can't wait for the funny videos. Love the ones I've seen before. Thank you. This is a good idea. My heart dropped for a minute. I thought I made it pretty clear that it was just the daily uploads that were stopping. I do, do think the schedule will be just as great. Thank you. I'm taking special relativity. Can you explain the Lorentz transformation in the matrix form? Also, the conservation of momentum and energy. Conservation of momentum and energy in special relativity or in general? Because that's probably something you should have down before you get to special relativity. And I started, I feel like I've half started a million things. I started a derivation video on the Lorentz transform, but I never finished it. Um, as someone who doesn't have much or any knowledge of physics and loves your videos, an introduction to physics type video would be nice. It seems cool, dude. Look, good luck. Gonna miss the videos. Really excited to watch the weekly vlogs. Thank you so much for all the daily videos. They were, I mean, they were fun for me. I had a lot of fun making them all. Why the change? Part of it, I just wanted to do something different. I think that they were getting a little bit stale. And with the schedule, since I'm now also TAing, it just made it so that the the middle level or the middle quality daily uploads that I was making would become even less high quality. I, was, I didn't want to do that anymore. So I just needed a change. Tuesdays. Oh, I love your videos, man. Might make my own daily vids. Thanks for the inspiration. It was the best way that I could think of to just get better at editing and to have an excuse to do something physics related every single day. Uh, oh, oh, yeah. I missed... So... Brandon Soto, you comment this on every single video, and I think the last two or so, I forgot to respond back, so I'm sorry about that. Sounds good. Oh my god, I want to cry. Don't cry. Don't do that. I love this, and I'm looking forward and up to the future of your channel. I cannot tell you enough. Can I read today? Cannot tell you enough how much your uploading means to me. It got me through life when I was feeling down. Obs absolutely love your joke vids, and one day I'll understand your heavy math and physics vids. Well, really, that was a really nice comment. I like. I'm happy to help in any way that I can. NP.py. Import num and NumPy as NP. I I miss coding. I haven't had to use Python in months. Goodbye, Dunton. Please don't go. A Jesse Kyle on deck once a week is a great idea. He could disprove your heavy math Tuesdays. Let's celebrate by releasing your actual age. Everyone knows that I am nine years old. Hey, Andrew, have, uh, have you thought about what you'd like to do as a job after you get your PhD? I'm going to be a physicist. I'm going to be a theoretical physicist. I don't know if I want to be a theoretical physicist who does research in lattice quantum chromodynamics or perturbative quantum chromodynamics, but I hope to figure that out maybe at some point this year. At 106, I probably misspelled Tuesday again.
Oh, I guess I commented on this one. No, that's just how Tuesday is. I mean, I'm funny. Uh, I know, I know what I'm watching every Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday. Oh, oh. Uh, oh, are we already at the end of the comments? Who is Jesse Kyle? Everyone knows Jesse Kyle is my twin brother. He got me out of a out of a pretty tough scrape with Dr. Phil back in the day when I made my very controversial discovery. But that's it. That's the comments. 145 of them. I skipped over some of them that just said like, no, or cool or something like that. It's not all of them are featured in this video. So that is what you all had to say. This is the end of an era, but it's not a bad thing. I think it's a good change. I'm super excited to be making these different types of videos in the future. I might, may or may not be uploading throughout the rest of the week, but it'll for sure be starting back up on Tuesday with this new schedule. Uh, feel free to always let me know in the comment section suggestions of videos that you would like to see. And as always, I'll see you guys there.